He messed it up. <laughs> hey, what's going on out there, everybody? Hey, I'm back with another video, but today I'm back with a tip. I'm actually back with uh, giving you a tip on just general knowledge, just general stuff. Uh, but I'm going to do something a little different this time. I will always come on and try to give advice and give little tips about different things, you know what I'm saying, that goes on with the kennel or just, you know, life in general. But this time I'm about to get ready to ask my son a question. He have no idea what I'm about to ask him. The question I'm about to ask my son is, um, could you, well, just share with the people something that I stress to you all the time for us that make a help them that I tell you all the time. All right. Well, the one thing that my father has stressed to me a lot about is that life don't owe you nothing unless. Wait, wait, mm, wait, 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 wait. Life don't owe you nothing. If you want to get something, you have to go and get it. That's right. That's right. And uh, he messed it up. <laughs> <laughs> shouldn't have showed that part. Though. I should have showed that part. I said shouldn't. Shouldn't. But you gotta understand. That's the best part about it. Is. We don't be cutting it and trying to script and act this stuff out. We just, you know what I'm saying, just keep it 100, keep it real. But you got to understand, he wasn't ready for the question. So it's different once you're ready and you prepare for it. And that's how you have to look at life. Life, you can't prepare yourself for life. Because it's going to always throw you different curveballs and going to throw you different things that you are really not expecting. So the same way I asked you the question just spurred a moment like that is the same way life will hit you. So therefore, you have to prepare yourself as in being prepared for the unexpected on different things that happen in life. So I just want to come on and share that little quick thing with y'all, a quick tip. And uh, you actually did a good job. Thank, Thank you, Dale. He actually did a good job because he wasn't ready for it, but he understood and he answered quickly. He didn't get caught up trying to figure it out, but he knew what he wanted to say. It just didn't come out as fast as he wanted to say it at the moment. But I just want to come on and just share a little quick tip with y'all. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching, everybody. We accelerate. Motivated. Yeah, we took the stairs while the girls waited. Felt obligated to achieve.